Ogo Ora, a town in southwestern Oyo State in Nigeria, boasts of having the highest concentration of multiple births of any place on the globe. To celebrate its self-proclaimed title, the town hosts an annual festival which started in 2018, drawing hundreds of sets of twins from around the country. Here is more on the story. On a normal day, a visitor might pass through Igbo Ora with little more than a double take, wondering why so many pairs of residents wear matching clothes. With fanfare, pageantry, talent shows, and even a royal visit, hundreds of people gathered in the self-proclaimed twins capital of the world to celebrate its unusually high rate of multiple births. This is my first time giving birth to a set of twins, and it has changed my life. People give us gifts. Even when we ride a motorbike, some riders give us the ride for free. Whenever we go somewhere, people give the twins cash as presents. You can't give birth to twins and remain down on your luck. Population experts say the Yoruba-speaking Southwest has one of the highest twinning rates in Nigeria. The global average birth rate for twins is around 12 per 1,000 births. But in Igbo Ora, it is thought to be closer to 50 per 1,000, according to scientific studies and hospital records. Explanations for the abundance differ. Many residents put it down to diet, especially okra leaf or elasa soup with yam and amala. People believe it is the soup we eat here that contributes to us conceiving twins. They think it's because of the elasa soup we eat, but I don't know if that's true. Twins are seen as a blessing by many. Twins bring favor, fame, wealth to the parents that have them and they are kind of unique way. That's why you in Yoruba we celebrate their birth. And maybe that is one of the reasons why God bless us in Yoruba land with the highest number of twins in the world. And that is why we are here to celebrate World Twins Festival. Scientists are looking into genetic factors and how the twins' special cultural status might make them more likely to find partners and have children. Uh, by the grace of God, I believe strongly that this festival will become a global uh, festival that twins from all over the world uh, will be coming to Nigeria, to Igora, to celebrate themselves. Uh, I'm looking forward to that very soon. In pre-colonial times, twins were often regarded as evil and were either banished to the evil forest or killed. Scottish missionary Mary Slessor is widely credited with helping to curb the practice in the late 19th century.